This is a 1976 Chevy Vega hatchback, but it's equipped a little differently from original. This is a 350 cubic inch Chevy engine. The aluminum four would have been the standard uh, equipment in this car. That had uh, aluminum block and uh, cast iron head which create problems for that engine. So many of these early Vegas had severe engine problems centering around the gasket that uh, went between the, the block and the head. But this car would really be able to surmount all those problems with this uh, 350 V8. Now a lot of people made conversions of these cars and would use an engine like this to uh, eliminate uh, any engine problems. This one still has an automatic transmission. It originally, judging from the controls there, had air conditioning, but <clears throat> of course there is no, re no uh, room, I'm sure, under the hood for air conditioning for uh, this car with this V8 configuration. And the hatch is open on this car so you get an idea of what the uh, what it looked like back there. Actually the, the trunk area was fairly shallow so if you attempted to carry anything of any size here in the uh, back area, you had to be careful when you closed the hatch that uh, whatever you had back there didn't impact the glass. Uh, they have put SS here on the on the back end of the uh, car and on the fenders, and uh, well, there was no Vega SS. But it does give you an idea that this, in fact, does have a, a quite a power plant. Notice the nice wheels that they put on the car, too. Put a couple extra gauges there in the uh, dash, but they're nicely mounted in the dash. Notice the headers there. It's a tight fit for a V8 under this hood.